Today I'm going to teach you how to transform into her. Her, of course, is the beautiful Vivian Lee, and I want to do this makeup that she has from Caesar and Cleopatra. It looks super mattified, so I'm starting out with e.l.f. putty primer. She always has this very unreal looking airbrush porcelain skin base, so I'm starting out with more of a luminous hydrating primer because I'm going to be using a lot of powder later. Only the best foundation for Miss Lee. <laughs> and the blue and white dots are mixing pigments that just change my undertone a little bit so that this matches my skin better. Starting with the brows, as always, I put concealer concealer underneath and on top of my brows and I'm gonna put it right over the tail of my brows. Her brows fluctuate a lot. Even in this shot from the same movie they look totally different from the last picture. To keep it simple I just redrew mine thinner and darker. Contouring away my square or jaw, forehead, starting to draw in her nose shape. I made this little V here. I drew my nostrils a little bit higher. Went besides the nostrils here to kind of widen it. She has amazing cheeks so I add a little bit of contour under here to really pop the apples of our cheeks out. She has a really pretty teardrop shape in her philtrum that I added. Taking this peach shade all over my lid. With my eyes open, I'm gonna dip into this light brown shade. I'm just gonna go right in with it at my crease. The white in this palette is perfect for under the brow. And I'm just taking mine right down into the upper cheek because hers is very blended. She has a peachy shade in her waterline that wings out a little bit on the outer corner and in the inner corner. I used CoverGirl liquid liner in brown for most of the eyeliner on the upper lid. And then I drew in this little outline around our white inner corner liner. Added a black gel liner. Kind of shook that she doesn't have false lashes on, but I guess it makes sense because Cleopatra wouldn't have worn false lashes. I need mine to look good, so I'm going to try out this Sky High Maybelline with the primer today. This primer is black, which I really like, and it says you can wear it alone for a natural look, so I'm going to use that on my bottom lashes to get rid of this white cast from the white liner. Am I crazy, or is this primer looking like very nice? Is it, can you see it? <laughs> I'm gonna use rose ink and azalea right on top of the cheekbones. It doesn't look like her blush is super heavy here. This might be a colorized photo though, so I'm not sure. Lining my lips with Makeup by Mario and Chris. Brick red for the lip. Setting the high points of my face with RCMA No Color Powder so we can keep those super bright. I set the nose contour with a contour powder so that we could get back some of her nose shape. Added the wig and this beautiful dress. I feel like it kind of gives modern Scarlett O'Hara. <laughs> And here's the final look! 